Good evening and welcome to tonight's edition of Mrs. Sophie's Storytime. Tonight I'm going to be reading a story to you called Found You, Little Wombat. And this was written by Angela McAllister. Little Wombat was playing hide and seek with Rabbit and Koala. Found you, said Koala. Now it's your turn to seek, Little Wombat, said Rabbit. Rabbit and Koala hid, and so did Little Wombat. They waited and waited and tried to keep very quiet. So did Little Wombat. Let's start again, said Koala with a chuckle. You have to count to ten and then come and find us. Little Wombat shut his eyes. Two, ten. No, no, count ten flowers before you come and find us, called Rabbit and Koala as they ran away to hide. One, counted Little Wombat, but he soon became distracted and began to look around. Little Wombat wandered over a hill to see what was on the other side. He didn't notice a cloud creep in front of the sun. He didn't notice the, sun, the sky turn gray. He didn't notice the wind shake the trees. He suddenly remembered that Rabbit and Koala were hiding. Ten! I'm coming! He shouted. But where was Koala? Where was Rabbit? Little Wombat fell all alone. Where am I? He asked. Drip, drip. Raindrops started to fall from a small dark cloud. Drip, drip. Teardrops started to fall from a small lost wombat. But the sun didn't hide for long and neither did little wombat. Hmm, that's a very wobbly toadstool. Found you, said mom. What a clever umbrella. Let's splash in the puddles on the way home, said rabbit. So little wombat jumped and made the biggest, happiest splash of all. The end. I hope you enjoyed tonight's story and we will see you tomorrow for First Chapter Friday. Good night.